Hello and welcome to Football Newsroom. Today we are going to discuss about the results of match day 15 and the fixtures of match day 16. We've also got few transfer rumors for you and we are also going to give you the recent updates on injuries. It was an exciting week in the Premier League. Manchester City defeated Burnley by 4-1 as Gabriel Jesus scored a breast and Rodrigo and Mahrez scored one each. Chelsea defeated Aston Villa by two goals to one. Mason Mount and Tammy Abraham, the two exciting youths of Chelsea, scored to give them the victory. Trezeguet scored one for Aston Villa. Leicester City won by 2-0 against Watford. Jimmy Vardy converted from the penalty spot and Madison doubled the lead in the injury time. Now let's move on to the big match of this week. It was Manchester United against Tottenham at the Old Trafford. It was indeed a gem of a match which saw Manchester United defeat Tottenham by two goals to one. It was a chance for Jose Mourinho to take revenge, but his side failed to live up to the expectations. Marcus Rashford scored at the very beginning of the match on the 6th minute mark. It was a blitzkrieg down the right which saw Gazaniga concede cheaply. Dele Alli equalised on the 39th minute for Tottenham, but the lead didn't last long as Rashford was stripped inside the box by Sissoko and he calmly finished from the spot. Rashford put up a stellar performance as he fetched the victory for Manu. Liverpool thumped Everton 5-2 in the derby. Divock Orihi scored twice, whereas Zadan Shakiri and Sadio Mane scored one each. Jorginho Wijnaldum also scored during the dying minutes of the game. Michael Keane and Richarlison scored for Everton. Liverpool boss Jurgen Klopp still has faith on Shakiri and believes that he has a good future. Shakiri had an impressive night against Everton after starting for the first time since January in the Premier League. He also scored one goal for Liverpool against Everton. And it was another shocking defeat for Arsenal as they lost against Brighton by 2-1. After Unai Emery being sacked, this was the first game for Freddie Leungberg as the head coach, but he couldn't lead his team to victory. Webster and Mopé scored for Brighton and Alexandre Lacazette scored for Arsenal. Everton has sacked Marco Silva as their head coach after the defeat against Liverpool. Let's see who is going to replace him. Now coming to the points table, Liverpool comfortably sit at the top being 8 points ahead of 2nd place Leicester City with 43 points from 15 games. Leicester City, who are having a decent season, are at the 2nd spot with 35 points from 15 games. Manchester City are at the 3rd spot with 32 points and Chelsea at the 4th position with 29 points. Manchester United are at the 6th spot with 21 points. Tottenham are 8th with 20 points and Arsenal at the 10th position with 19 points from 15 games. Now moving on to the Spanish Giants. It's a sad news for Real Madrid fans as Eden Hazard, their star recruitment for this season, is set to miss the first El Clasico of this season due to a fracture in his right ankle. It's a major setback for Real Madrid. Barcelona have raised teenage star Ansu Fati's release clause from 100 million to 170 million euros, which ties in with the team till July 2022. However, this release clause will bump up to a whooping 400 million when he signs a professional contract with the first team. We've also come across a few transfer rumours this week. Usman Dembele's agent, Sissoko is looking for new clubs and the Premier League clubs are an option. It looks as if Barca might have lost faith on him due to his fitness and it seems that we might see him play for another club if Ansu keeps growing. Clubs like Manchester City and Arsenal have showed interest for him. Especially, City would like to take him in their team if Leroy Sané moves to Bayern Munich. Jadon Sancho is also likely to move to the Premier League as he is not getting a chance to prove himself in Dortmund. Clubs like Manchester United and Chelsea have shown interests to buy this promising youth. Now let's focus to the match day 16 of the Premier League. Sergio Aguero is also set to miss the Manchester derby due to the thigh injury he sustained against Chelsea and Gabriel Jesus, who had an excellent game against Brighton, is probably going to replace him. Now let's focus to the match day 16 of Premier League. Chelsea are going to face Everton on the 7th of December from 12.30 pm England Standard Time. League leaders Liverpool will play an away fixture against Bournemouth on the same day from 3 pm. Tottenham will also face Burnley on Saturday. The Manchester Derby will kick off at 5.30 pm from Etihad Stadium. Later on Tuesday, Arsenal will face West Ham from 9 pm. In the La Liga, Atletico Madrid are going to face Villarreal on the 6th of December from 9 pm Spain Standard Time. Real Madrid face Espanyol at the Santiago Bernabeu from 1 pm on 7th of December. FC Barcelona will play against RCD Mallorca on the 7th of December from 9 pm. That's it for today. Thank you for joining me. 
please stay tuned for the match preview of the Manchester Derby coming soon. Please leave a like if you like the video and do share your thoughts on the comment box and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.